Hi guys, good morning. It's early in the morning. We are having a fancy if it fits your macros breakfast this morning. It's treat day, so we're doing a little bit more of a fancier breakfast. Normally we just have eggs and a little bit of um, low sugar ketchup. Today we had our eggs and we're also having low carb bagels. These are called Dream Bagels by Baker's Deluxe. And this is the sesame one. Um, they are 160 calories, three and a half grams of fat, 18 grams of carbs, 17 grams of fiber, and 14 grams of protein. So it's actually a really, really good macro bagel. Um, we also have the everything. We haven't tried it yet. We're still on the sesame. So we're just gonna toast these up and then we're gonna put some low fat strawberry che cream cheese on here and get a look at that. It is for one tablespoon, 30 calories, two fat, three carbs and three sugar and one protein. So we're gonna toast up our bagels and then we'll show you what else we're having. Okay, while our bagels are toasting, we are going to try the PB2 sample that we got from the lowcarbgrocery.net. Um, this is just the powdered peanut butter. It's 85% less fat. We're gonna put it on half of a banana each. We don't eat bananas during the week because they're pretty high in carbs and sugar. Even though it's natural sugars, we still find that we lose more weight when we don't take in bananas as much, so they're a treat. This, for two tablespoons, it's 45 calories, one and a half grams of fat, five carbs, two fiber, five protein, and one sugar. What you do is you pour the package in a bowl, and then you mix it with two tablespoons of water, and it basically tastes like peanut butter, and it spreads like peanut butter and everything, It's just lower in calories and fat. Um, we've tried the chocolate PB2 and it was really good. You liked it too, right? We put it yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, the chocolate PB2 was awesome. So I'm excited to try the regular. Then we just stir. I was really surprised that you can turn powder and water into uh, peanut butter. Like the consistency too is pretty pretty good. Yeah, it it really it really does look and taste and spread like peanut butter yeah, it's good stuff. it basically I think they just take out all the oil I think they just basically like dry out the nuts and then you reconstitute it with water and that kind of gets rid of some of the fat yeah. so let's spread this on our bananas <laughs> okay mm. <laughs> I'm gonna cut it you know you're eating clean when this is a treat for you, eating a banana with a little bit of peanut butter. Is that good? Do you like that? Perfect. Okay. Mmm, looking good. Yeah. Okay, so. Thanks for making mine up, too. No problem. Oh, I should put a little more peanut butter on yours because you like it. Well, try yours out first. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, here it goes. Oops, it's a little messy. Mmm. Good treat. It's mm -hmm. a good different breakfast we're having today. I'm pretty excited about it. Actually, that's really good. Oh, yeah, buddy. It gives you the peanut butter. It's not as strong of a peanut butter flavor, but it tastes like peanut butter. It, be, it, it gives you all the peanut buttery goodness that you crave without the extra fat and carbs. Yeah. Mm. What do you think? That's really good. Yeah, the I, I, the peanut, chocolate. Yeah, it's peanut buttery and uh, pretty good stuff. The chocolate is is good, but this this is really good too. Mm -hmm. They're both really good substitutions for peanut butter. Banana and peanut butter is a great combo. Yes, it is. Great treat for Friday treat day. Mmm. Okay. How's mm. that? You like that? Yep. Strawberry cream cheese, low fat on a uh, low carb bagel. 
it just for the macros it's such a good fill in for a bagel it's not as like bready i don't know how to explain it like it's dense. not as chewy and dense yeah. as a bagel but it gives you that bagel craving just like the pb2 and the cream cheese just adds to it hank is hoping he'll get some <laughs> whenever we're eating in the kitchen you can always find mr hank not too far away mm. it toasts up nicely like a bagel yeah um it just for less for like half sorry <laughs> half the carbs of a normal bagel it's amazing oh, it's yeah. totally worth it totally worth you get six in a bag i think they were about five or six dollars but they're totally worth it for the macros and there's 14 grams of protein in one bagel that's amazing and we don't eat these all the time like this is a once in a blue moon kind of thing once every few weeks like we got our order i think at the beginning of september it's almost october in a couple days and we still have two left in our bag so we've only had two each so we don't eat them very often, but they're a treat when we do. Oh yeah, they are. Hey, you have some. Yeah, look at that. It feels like a bagel. Toast up like a bagel. Let's see if it tastes like one. <laughs> mm. Is it bagely goodness? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's good. Real good. <laughs> yeah, like you said, it's not... It doesn't have that dense chewiness, but it's definitely a bagel. Like it's not, doesn't taste like it's a diet or like you're missing out on anything. No, it doesn't. It's actually quite delicious. They did a really good job yeah. giving you the taste of a bagel without the carbs and calories. I really like that low fat uh, strawberry cream cheese. Man, that's good. Me too. I've been craving strawberry cream cheese. And, and I had never tried that before. No, no. I had it once. One of my family members used to get it all the time on a plain white bagel. Mm. And I always crave it now because we can't eat it. Well, we choose not to eat it. And when I seen the low fat one, I knew we had to try it. Oh yeah, it's awesome. Really good stuff. I'm gonna enjoy my bagel now. Me too. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, this is, you know, just so you can see different um, food items that we use. There are tons of options. If you're dieting or cutting or whatever you want to call it, and you're looking and craving carbs or craving something that you think you can't have, there are tons of options out there now. You just got to get creative and you got to look online. You got it. <laughs> and we had had some requests actually for some um, different breakfast ideas. So. Yes. There you go. Yeah, so this is this is a great breakfast. And and you don't have to have a full banana. Like we split a banana. You still get that banana craving out of the way. Yeah, your peanut butter craving. Your bagel, your cream cheese, oh, and yeah. all for really decent carbs, macros. Um it's just delicious. That was really a, a good change for us from the typical eggs and veggie breakfast that we usually eat. Yeah. It was a beautiful, happy Friday treat day breakfast. Yep. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>